So you're either here because you want to genuinely learn about cache memories or you're probably here because your coworker or your friend told you that Intel has L3 cache while AMD doesn't, so Intel is better. So anyways, it's great that you guys are here and before you change your mind, let's begin. I'm Abhishek to the Wheels and Chips and this is an in shot about L2 versus L3 caches. So let's begin. Well, for starters, caches act as an intermediate buffer between the CPU and the RAM. Yep, they are pretty faster than the RAM, immaterial of whether they are the L1 cache or the L2 cache or the L3 cache. They're still going to be faster than the RAM or the SSD. So yeah, caches are pretty darn important. So caches act as a place where CPU stores the most relevant or the most frequently used data to access it immediately as soon as it wants to before reaching the RAM. So once the cache memory fills up, then it has to reach the RAM obviously. And that's why you have different levels of cache, L1, L2 and L3. So depending on the levels of cache, the speeds vary. And this is pretty important one, so stay with me on this one. An L2 cache will definitely be faster than an L3 cache. Now before you start saying, wow Shake, how could that even be possible? I always thought that an L3 cache meant a level 3 and that's obviously going to be better than a level 2 cache because that's how we play in video games. Level 3 is always better than level 2. Well, that doesn't quite work over here and the logics have been reversed. So I don't know how that's going. But yeah, based on the current assumptions, the L1 is the one which sits closest to the CPU. That means the CPU interacts with the L1 a lot more. But we don't see the question about L1 being better than L2 or L3 because the L1 is always going to be present. Whether it's going to be an Intel or an AMD, that doesn't matter. All of these have an L1 cache because it's the fastest way a CPU can interact with a buffered memory. And when it comes to the L2 cache, the things are entirely different. And different companies use different amounts of L2 caches. Intel, for example, uses very minimum L2 cache while it spends most of its money on an L3 cache instead of, I don't know, going for a lot of L2 cache. And I frankly have no idea why Intel does that. Anyways, AMD spends more on an L2 cache and eliminates the need for an L3 cache. That's why they don't have L3 caches. For example, if an Intel and an AMD are available in the same price bracket, an Intel would most likely have a total of 1 MB of L2 cache based on 256 KB per course on a 4 core CPU and a 6 MB of L3 cache. But a similar priced AMD CPU would probably have around 1 MB or 2 MB of L2 cache per core that makes it at least 8 MB depending on an octa-core or a 16 MB if you're on a very higher variant of an octa-core. So yeah, AMD does sound better right now than the shiny Intel you were arguing about, right? But unfortunately, things don't work that way. And there are different reasons as to why different brands opt different types of caches. And on a performance level, we don't only count the caches and we count the entire performance of the CPU coupled with the entire system, including the OS. So yeah, that's about it for this video. Hope you learned about the L1 cache and the L2 cache and the L3 cache and caches in general. And if you did, please do hit the like button on the video down below. And if you like this video so much that you want to watch similar videos, I'd recommend hitting the subscribe button that's beside the like button or probably closer to the like button somewhere. Anyways, uh, just hit subscribe if you want to watch a lot of more videos and please do comment down below uh, what types of videos you expect from us and I believe someone wanted an L2 versus L3 cache video and that's why we made this one in the first place. Well guys, thanks a ton for watching and yeah, again, uh, do like it if you like it or dislike it if you don't like it but please do comment down below why you disliked it and as always, take care, bye.